Hi, in this lesson, we are going to talk about arithmetic series. At the end of this lesson, students should be able to accurately differentiate an arithmetic series from arithmetic sequence. Correctly solve for the sum of the first n terms of an arithmetic sequence and correctly solve real life problems involving arithmetic series. So what is an arithmetic series? So it refers to the sum of the first n terms of an arithmetic sequence written as a sub n equals a sub 1 plus a sub 2 plus a sub 3 plus dot 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 plus a sub n. So meaning, um, um, in an arithmetic sequence, pag i-add mo lahat ng terms ng arithmetic sequence, then that would be arithmetic series. Okay? Arithmetic series. Example, the sum of the first five terms of the arithmetic series, 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus dot dot dot, is, so we are talking about five terms, first five terms. So that is denoted by S sub 5. So we have here S sub n. So our n is 5 because we are looking for the first five terms. And so that will be 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 9 equals 25. So, calculator mo lang yan. Add mo, so that's 25. So, therefore, the sum of the first five terms of the arithmetic series is 25. Now, this is okay if uh, we are talking about the sum of first few terms. Okay? Kung po konti lang yung terms na hinahanap, pwedeng i-manual ng add. Kaya lang, halimbawa, uh, finding the first 50 terms, first 20 terms. So, that would be laborious if we are going to add them manually. So, therefore, we need to have a general formula for that. So, we have here the arithmetic series a sub 1 plus a sub 2 plus dot 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 plus a sub n. It can be solved using the following formula, this one. So, you need to memorize this. Write this in your notebook. So, s sub n equals n over 2 times a sub 1 plus a sub n. So, our n, of course, it's the specified number of terms. So, if we are looking for the first 5 terms, so our n is 5. If we are looking for the first 10 terms, our n is 10. So, whatever your n here, that must also be your val the value of n here. So, n over 2. And then, we multiply that to the first term and to the last term. Okay? Example. The sum of the first 10 positive integers can be solved using the arithmetic series. Given that a sub 1 equals 1 and a sub 10 equals 10 and n equals 1, it follows that um, it's not n equals 1, it's n equals 10. It follows that a sub n equals n over 2 times a sub 1 plus a sub n. So, we are looking for the first 10 positive integers. What are the first 10 positive integers? So, that's 1 plus 2, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay? So, the first term is 1. So, a sub 1 is 1. We are looking for the first 10 terms. So, that's our n is 10. Okay? So, it's also 10 here. First term is 1. And, of course, the last term is 10. And so, solving that, we have, uh, 10 divided by 2, that's 5. 1 plus 10, that's 11. So, 5 times 11, that gives you 55. So, the sum of the first 10 positive integers is 55. Another example. Find the sum of the terms of an arithmetic series given that a sub 1 equals 6, a sub n equals 82, and your n is 20. So, ang first term natin ay 6, and yung last term ay 82, and we are looking for the sum of the first 20 terms. Okay? So, we are going to use this formula, S sub n equals n over 2 times A sub 1 plus A sub n. Substituting that, we have A sub 1, first term is 6, ang last term natin ay 82, ang n natin ay 20. So, we get S sub 20 equals 20 divided by 2 times 6 plus 82. And that gives you, this is 88 
this is 10. So we have 10 times 88, that's 880. So that is the sum of the terms of the given arithmetic series. Okay. So the sum of the first 20 terms is 880. So with this formula, this is very easy because we only have the number of terms that we are adding. I divide mo lang yan sa 2 and then yung first term at saka yung last term. We can, all, we can only use this formula if we are given the last term. Okay. Pero pag hindi naman, we are going to use another formula. Okay. Just like this one. Find the sum of the first 20 terms of the arithmetic sequence 3, 5, 7, 9, and so on. So this is an arithmetic sequence. Let's see. Kung my common difference, we have 5 minus 3, that's 2. 7 minus 5, 2. 9 minus 7, that's 2. Okay, it's an arithmetic sequence. So we are looking for the sum of the first 20 terms. And since in this example, we have the first term, but we do not know the last term. So in that case, we cannot use the previous formula, which is this one. So hindi natin ito pwedeng gamitin kasi we do not know the last term. However, we can use another formula and that would be almost the same. We have S sub N equals N over 2, that's always N over 2, times Dalawang beses natin kukunin ang a sub 1. So, that's 2 times a sub 1. So, dalawang first term yan. Okay? 2 times a sub 1 plus n minus 1 times d. It comes from the original, uh, it comes from the general term of an arithmetic sequence. Okay? So, we make use of the common difference. Okay? Common difference. So, substituting, we have, of course, we are looking for the first 20 terms. So, that's S sub N because our N is 20. 20, ayan, 20 yung N natin over 2. Yung A sub 1 natin, that's the first term. We have 3. And so, N, 20 pa rin yan, minus 1. The common difference is 5 minus 3, that's 2. Substituting that, we have S sub 20 equals 20 over 2 times 2 times 3. It's always 2, ayan, yung first term i3, plus yung n i20, always minus 1, and then the common difference is 2. Okay, solving this, we have 2 times 3, that's 6, 20 minus 1, that's 19, 19 times 2, that's give you, uh, that, give you, that gives you 38, so 6 plus 38, that's 44 times 10, so that's 440. So therefore, the, the sum of the first 20 terms of the arithmetic sequence 3, 5, 7, 9, and so on, is 440. So, let's try this. Find the sum of the fir first 50 natural numbers. Ito yung uh, number 1. It's just like the example we had. Yung sa first 10 positive. Ito yan. First 10 positive integers. Kaya lang ito, first 10 numbers. Okay? Yung sa try this, Yung uh, sasagutan niyo, it's first 50 natural. When we say natural numbers, these are counting numbers. So, we start at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, 50 na ganyan. Hanggang 50th term. So, i-add mo yun. Using the first formula. So, number 2 naman, find, uh, find the sum. Ito, find the sum of the first 15 terms of the arithmetic sequence. 1, 4, 7, 10, and so on. Since we... We do not know the last term. Since we do not know the last term, we are going to use uh, the second formula. Okay, we're in. Uh, we need to find the common difference. Okay, so I want you to write this in your notebook. Copy and answer. And um, I want everyone to submit um, the picture of uh, your answers. You can send it to me privately in Messenger. Right? So, uh, hint lang, yung natural numbers, those are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, it starts, at, it starts at 1. And so, the 50th term is also 50. 
right? And use the first um, formula that we had for the series.